ChatGPT has long-term memory now. We don't know exactly how it works, so I thought we'd speculate a little. So for a while now, ChatGPT, or at least paid for ChatGPT, it's like Plus or Enterprise, has done a thing called recording memories, where it will intervene sometimes in your conversation and say, hey, I've just recorded the fact that whatever you have just said as a memory. And again, we don't exactly know how this works, but it was small snippets of things. So you might say like, hey, my name is Gonzo. And it would go, oh, OK, cool. I have recorded the fact that your name is Gonzo as a memory. Here's how I think that worked. And then let's get on to how I think the new memories work. To the whiteboard. So you have conversations. And conversations inside ChatGPT are turn by turn. So you have, um, you start with you, and then there's AI, and then there's you, and then AI and you, and so on. And what happens inside a conversation is, I'm going to play fast and loose a little bit here, but basically when it wants to generate an answer, it reads the entire conversation, or it's got a rolling context window, don't worry about it, it doesn't matter, but it reads all of that in to produce the best answer you can. And what I think happened for the old world is that when you came up with a memory, what it did is it just stored that as literal text in a file somewhere, like over here, like some form of JSON. And it had instructions and tool calling so that when you wrote something down or when you needed a prompt, it said, hey, before you write that prompt, just check if there's any information out in this memory over here. But now what I think they're doing is like big rag, big retrieval augmented generation over all of your conversations if you let it. So there will be, instead of this like tiny bit of JSON over here that just has like a couple of facts in it, there is a big sod off vector database of all of your responses ever. And one of the things that it's instructed to do, so let's make this big vector database over here, We'll talk about vector databases because they're cool and interesting and we should get into them, but that's for another time. Every time you respond and require some text, it's got the instruction to look up in here and see if there are any relevant facts, which also allows it to hop between conversations and say, oh, in our conversation ages ago, you said this, so that's relevant to this conversation as well. 